So what happened the last time you were in Van Harn? I still don't know how you got Frey to stop We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. But he's a bit quicker to forget. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Beautiful. And, uh. It is what? also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? Freya's camp is too No rushes, right. that. Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. To Freya's camp, then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her, though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. And there is much I owe her. No one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildis Vini! Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh... I am so... so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor... and friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Where's Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Vigvir. They've been captured by the Einherjar. Hey, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy. Tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, it'd be a fellow giant. Very well. You don't disappoint me. Continue down this path and you'll find their dead. And don't shoot any. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken <laughs> promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. 
Curiosity's all well and good, but so is privacy, huh? Okay, okay. Point taken. Feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfheim, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros, Greek for humid. Egros. I like it. It's making these things stronger! This excursion into Vanai means you've now visited each of the Nine Realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. Thought as Vini said both Frey and Bigvir were captured. 
Big Fear's the light elf who wanted to learn more about that library in Alfheim, right? Correct. An exiled scholar married to a warrior, Bela. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. And I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. Hope he's okay. You once told us Ragnarok begins when Skull and Hati catch the sun and moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. <laughs> Prophecy. Which after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. <laughs> That's gotta be why the Einherjar stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah. Or that, I guess. <laughs> Alka! Alchemist. 
Got a new guess. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hearty, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, best we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. The Aenor Yar played a part according to Skolonati's shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? Bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try that first. But the side told us being in the elves. Who else was part of Freyr's army? Not much army, really. Although Beer Girl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill. That's nice. Ain't heading our head. Here. They hide. The Vanir aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. <clears throat> This 
still. When I bring it down, we strike. Yep. Uh. Empty. Where'd they all go? Wait, there's the moon. Hoping that puts a dent in Odin's forces, at least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. Hey! Hurry! She's getting away! Come on! <laughs> does that you know what we're doing right now all of this it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in skull and hathi shrine the wolves are back in vanaheim we're rescuing the moon yes i remember the prophecy so doesn't it make you worried if everything we're doing now happened in the yonar shrine remember our agreement prophecy will not dictate our actions yeah our allies need help. That is our focus now. Oh, what is that? <laughs> oh, I'm a nasty beast. Get up alive. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
Old. Is this? It's from Helheim. Heimdall must have grabbed this while I freed Garm. Ugh. I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father. How are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot Who afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the giant said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. Doing all this, what if we're walking straight into Ragnarok? Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from? Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. I guess nothing. like inside their shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Good choice, lad. They have a gift for us. A way to call them anytime we need them. Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. 
Perhaps Freya will know. So in essence, they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hilda's Finney and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the cap. <laughs> That wasn't the same one from earlier, was it? No. We'll come back fast. But not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these enemy are we can fight in, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. like the egros. So, we report back to Hildas Fini. Then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the light elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure. But if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, Father.
All the plants that want to kill us? No, oh, no. Only the carnaptious ones. wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blowthunder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bail has already prepped the as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. The fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. The this will be of use. Nice work with the wolves. I've never seen any clips in Vanaheim before. Yeah, that just sort of had me when freeze the moon. a lot of weird things. The moon in the box was on a whole new level. Time with the aim here, Yar, wasn't pleasant. But Lunda can patch people as well as armor. With some rest, he'll be fine. So, what now? How are we gonna rescue Freya? The others will distract the guards. You and I are on exfiltration. <laughs> You make up your mind. Hitting the road or chewing the fat? It's troubling. We can take him. Love the enthusiasm, but remember, you and I are... The wolves gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einherjar are holding fear in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Bigfear, the altars were once used to signal the wolves. And now we have just the scepter to do it. 